I feel like I'm opening a big ass candy bar. Oh! Moment of truth. Oh, all right. The Backfire Zealot S is the flagship high performance dual belt motor longboard. The successor to the Zealot, it has been upgraded in every aspect. The deck is a composite of maple, glass fiber, and ABS, making the ride smoother and less bumpy. It has two 875 watt high torque motors, giving it a top speed of 48 kilometers per hour or 30 miles per hour. And another bright point? The purple ambient light, originally white on the standard Zealot. More power, more color, more stability. This is what makes the Zealot S, the Zealot S. One interesting feature about the Zealot S's remote is that you can turn on the Zealot S remotely just by holding the power button. Now, you can't see it, but you can hear it. The Zelda S has three different speed modes that you can hit on the button like other boards, but this one is much cooler. The first one is easy mode. That'll make take you about 20 kilometers per hour. Second one is sport mode, where you have higher acceleration and you'll go about 40 kilometers per hour on that one. Last one is turbo mode, and that is the fastest, both in terms of speed and acceleration. And the top speed on this is 48 kilometers per hour. The remote itself feels really good because it's a lot more ergonomic in design. And plus, you've got this little loop here so that you can lose it really easily. See? Got it right there. With that said, the remote is not the most interesting part of the board. Riding it. Rush, hit that B. Zealot S has an advertised range of 30 to 40 kilometers, which is about 19 to 24 miles. It varies based on the weight of the person, and these stats that I stated are for someone equal to or under 80 kilograms. I'm about 85 kilograms, so that could bring the range a little bit down. Seriously, this is what the easy mode is like. You have the slowest acceleration and the lowest top speed. Now, this might be perfect for people getting used to the Zelda S for the first time, even for experienced riders. Now, let's see what sport mode is like. And if you ever buy one, do not squeeze the throttle. The top speed in sport mode is 38 kilometers per hour. And even in that mode, it still feels pretty fast. It'll make your hips pop. As much as I'd love to show you what this thing is like in top speed, I can't because, unfortunately, there's technically a speed limit. In my past review of the Onboard M1, I mentioned that you can cut corners easily due to its shorter length and kicktail. Being in toll, you will have to stop quickly because of all the bikers and drivers and scooters. Even with the length of the Zealot S, you can still dip to the side pretty low. The Zealot S can climb up 30 degree incline hills. One thing to note that it's better to climb up the hills either on sport or turbo mode. 
Having that extra acceleration will let you climb uphill much more quickly. Just make sure you have the legs for that. The board also has tight brakes that will help you climb down hills quickly enough and it'll help you regenerate battery. One thing to note that electric skateboards do not stop on the dime, they just give you a lot more friction for you to slow down. Sometimes you'll have to use your foot in order to make a hard brake. If you live in a congested tight city, the board is going to have a bit of a struggle with having to turn. In some instances, you will have to pick it up and walk around with it. The board is quite heavy though, weighing roughly about 9 to 10 kilograms. So try your best not to carry it around for long distances. Get out of the way! Because this is a flexible deck, some people feel that this is not going to be very stable when going at high speed, especially on turbo mode. However, that is not the case. Due to the CNC forged trucks, they give the board much more stability even when you're flying at that high speed. Regardless of how fast you're going, you'll always keep your center of gravity. The Zealot S is a fantastic board that is fit for experienced riders. With its powerful motors and large battery, it is great for commuting around the city and going for a chill ride. During the pandemic, it is important to keep your safety and distance, so make sure you buy one immediately. It is a bit of a hefty price to pay though, nearly a thousand dollars for all that speed and power. So in the following, use these discount codes in order to slice off a bit. And remember, make sure you follow the speed limit and wear your helmet at all times. Bad example.